The Tennessee Department of Children's Services went before the State yeah, Building Commission her, Thursday her. morning, Sorry. seeking approval for a series of real estate projects, including upgrading Wilder Youth Development Center in Fayette County. We need to upgrade and integrate additional electronic security to the entire site to monitor the facility and grounds. DCS Commissioner Margie Quinn explained Wilder, which DCS runs, wasn't built to handle the children currently there. WRG investigators have uncovered mounting concerns like fights, juveniles refusing to get off the roof, riots, staff locked in cells, and multiple escapes. DCS has admitted it needs more staff. Only recently were they approved to increase salaries. It says it's reduced the population and hired private security. Wilder YDC was constructed in the 1960s and does not have the extensive security measures we need today. Additional cameras and monitoring systems will assist in proper care for the youth in custody. While the board approved those security and other safety upgrades, they wanted to know what the future holds for Wilder. The uh, youth at Wilder were going to be moved to Nashville at some point and not use Wilder. Is that accurate or not accurate? We'll continue to use Wilder. Um, we will, we're in discussions about using Wilder in a different way. DCS says those discussions will continue as they try to figure out the best plan. But we do know it also got the green light to upgrade facilities across the state, adding more beds, including 75 at staff secured facilities for youth with less serious sentences. On any given day, we have between 65 and 75 youth waiting in detention centers across the state, local detention centers on those hardware secure and staff secure beds. Quinn suggesting to the board, ultimately, they plan on adding at least 500 more beds. Jessica Gortler, WREG News Channel 3.